ディズニー・ウィニー・ダブル・キング・オブ・ダ・ビースティーズディズニー・ウィニー・ダブル・キング・オブ・ダ・ビースティーズ One day while he was looking at pictures of wild animals, Tigger realized that he was related to the lion, the king of beasts. I must be a king too, said Tigger. We don't need a king, said Owl. Well, what if a wild jaguar was on the loose? Tigger asked. Who would protect you? Ham said the pool. Tigger had a plan. He stopped by Rabbit's house. When Rabbit wasn't home and borrowed a tablecloth, a pillow, and a broom. Then, using Rabbit's things, Tigger made a fierce looking jaguar and hung it from a tree. I don't want to scare them too much, he said to himself. I just want them to make me king. Soon, when everyone came near, Tiga began to bounce up and down. Jaguar, Jaguar, he cried. Run for your lives. Tiga ran up to the Jaguar and gave it, gave it a few fears. w a x with a stick. Then he tossed the jagger into a cage. Hooray for Tigger! cried the pool. He saved the earth. Tigger should be king. And so, just as he had wanted, Tigger was crowned king of the hundred acre wood. He began acting like a king right away. First of all, commanded King Tiger, from now on and forever, after the hundred acre wood shall be known as Tigaropolis. Next, King Tiger commanded his subjects to paint the trees in the Tigaropolis royal orange and black. Then he ordered everyone to bounce. But my feet are tired from all that painting, Pooh complained. Without saying a word, Tiga pointed to the caged jaguar. Pooh quickly began to bounce. He knew he should not argue with a king. Later, Rabbit wandered by. Huh. He said to himself, That looks like my table cloth, and that's my pillow. If Tigger wanted to borrow my things, he should have asked. I'll teach that Tigger a lesson. Rabbit grabbed the jaguar, left a note in its place, and went home. Soon, Owl came by. And so the note. He read it to King T- Tiger. I've freed my friend and taken him with me. Signed, another jaguar. Oops! Tiger muttered under his bre- breath. This new jaguar is probably real. So he sounded the alarm. Everywhere, head for the hills, he yelled. But Pooh just stood there, scratching his head. Shouldn't we try to capture the jaguar? he asked. You'll have to protect us, King Tiger, Piglet added. You're right, answered Tiger, gulping. Okay, everybody follow me. The jaguar's tracks led straight to Rabbit's house. Tiger burst through the door. It's the jaguar, he shouted. Pouncing on the beast. Tiger, Rabbit yelled, that's my table cloth. It is? said the Tiger, embraced. Oh, so it is. But don't forget, he added, 
There's still that other jagger out there, the one who wrote the note. There is no other jaguar, Rabbit declared. I wrote the note. I don't understand, King Tiga said, Piglet in a small voice. Tiga hung his head. I've got a confession to make, he said. I made up the jagger because I wanted to so much to be king. I guess I got carried away, he sniffed. I'm sorry. I suppose we could forgive you, Tiger, Piglet said. After all, you are our friend. That's right, said the Tiger, looking around happily. I'm your friend. But what about all that painting and bouncing? Pooh asked. I promise I won't ever do that stuff again, declared the Tiger. Come on, let's have a king uncrawling. Afterward, the former king declared, I feel like a new king, a, a, a new tiger, a bouncier tiger. Even if I'm not king, I'm still tiger. That's right, that's true, said the rabbit with a sigh. Tiger grinned, and I'm the only one.